All right, everybody, welcome back. Um, episode 11, I believe. All right, so in this one, uh, I brought up last episode that we're gonna try to go probably to the end dragon and uh, and kill kill it. So uh, this is what we're gonna do. Um, I'm gonna kill that skeleton first. Uh, no one is currently, oops, wrong tub. Uh, no one's currently on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run over and I'm gonna try to get some more ender pearls. Um, I got 56 gold, so I had like 26 in my uh, chest up on my house, um, and uh, I don't remember why I put that in there. Uh, I think I just had it because I was making, I made this netherite ingot, um, so I think that's why I did it. But anyway, we're going to run over here, and we're going to go to that little hole that we made, and uh, I doubt my piglins will still be in it, but we'll trap some in there at least. Um, and you know, we're just going to do everything we can to get... Uh, to get some uh, some uh, ender pearls, so uh, I did bring the blaze powder with me. So um, yeah, so that that's that's good. Uh, I at least have that. Um, so yeah, let's uh, let's do this. Um, yeah, it's a uh, end dragon's gonna be pretty big. Um, Hot and spicy and I have killed the end dragon, you know, several times together. Um, uh, and actually, not even always together. Uh, sometimes we, uh, I've done it by myself. Other times he's done it by himself. Um, it just depends uh, on like when when we were available and stuff. And, and you know that was all before before YouTube. So um, we uh, we didn't we didn't play as much together or try to play as much together as as we do now. Um, but. Uh, yeah, so now, uh, now that it's just now it's the two of us and that we have uh, uh, Nessa, uh, I think what we're gonna try to do is um, is do all this together. So, uh, you know, there are some uh, there are some um, Endermen around here. Uh, I don't really want to look at them and get them all excited and stuff. Uh, so, yeah. Anyway. There's some pig mother over there. Um, okay. Well, looks like what we're gonna have to do is, uh, oops, I am in the hole. Uh, it looks like what we're gonna have to do is, uh, probably find new piglin almost every single time. Um, which is kind of rough, but it's okay. So, let's just, uh, I know they're over here, so let's go over here. Uh, yeah, um, I think eventually we're gonna make a gold farm. Um, and what I would really like to do, and I remember seeing it on uh, the Hermitcraft server, is uh, I really would like to make a um, an automated farm for these piglins. Uh, I believe I saw it on uh, whose channel was that? It might have been Impulse, and uh, he made an automatic farm. And the way it worked is it would drop an iron ingot on this pressure pad, and uh, when oh there we go. Come on, buddy. Trade with me. Uh, yeah, anyway, so you drop an iron ingot on this pressure pad, and it would uh, open up a, this door. And so basically what would happen is as the uh, the, vil or the the piglin would pick it up, another one would dispense onto that pad. And uh, by it dispensing onto that pad, it, um, oh, they walk away. That is why I want to try to keep them in a hole, huh? a couple up there let's see if I could do this come on dude stay in there work with me there we go okay um, there's a couple of them up there you know it's just not gonna be worth it oh, I'm just gonna stick with this dude if another one comes along then we'll trade with him too but uh yeah, anyway, so, um, Impulse did it, so I, I think maybe I'll try to do something like that eventually. Um, you know, for, for now, uh, me just kind of finding them whenever I find them, that'll work. Um, I guess I could always bring a name tag, and then, you know, this, this will work. I could just bring a name tag, put them on, like, a hopper and stuff, and, and uh, you know, go from there, but, 
yeah, I think uh, for now, this is the way we're going to do it. So, um, let me, uh, let me fast forward all this. Uh, it's kind of a new feature I'm doing in these videos. So, you know, if you like it, let me know. Um, I think it, it, it stays a little personal, so that way you guys at least see uh, what I'm doing. It, um, but, uh, yeah, uh, maybe, we'll, maybe we'll try that. So anyway, yeah, let me uh, let me fast forward it, and uh, I'll see you in the end of this uh, 44 gold. Alright guys, so uh, we were able to get a few things from trading. Um, the the main thing is we got three ender pearls. Uh, we got a book, Soul Speed. Um, we got some arrows. Uh, other than that, just kind of a lot of junk. Um, this Crying Obsidian. I'm going to try this in the house, actually. Uh, the floor right now is uh, just blackstone. Uh, it's chiseled blackstone. Um, I'm going to see what it looks like to do... Uh, to do my black squares in the house out of that stuff. Uh, that might actually look kind of sick. Uh, so we'll see. But, uh, yeah. Um, let's run back. Run up to the house. I'll just keep all this in the one clip. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I text uh, Hot and Spicy, and uh, he said he's going to get on in a little bit. Um, so we'll be uh, kind of discussing things when that comes. Um, and most likely, I, I, uh, I'm going to kind of see if he wants to do go do the end dragon um yeah we'll see the, the main concern for me on that is uh, arrows you know we don't have many arrows so maybe we want to kind of work on that skeleton spawner first um yeah i don't know but yeah so right now i have these so let's say uh let me put these here if i take these out and i just do a couple like that That actually looks pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'm kind of... I don't know. It does add that blue is cool. Um, yeah, I don't know. Let's do a little bit more and see what it looks like. I'm kind of liking it, actually. Um, you know, I don't know how, uh, it, it, stuff isn't exactly easy to get, uh, but, yeah, it's kind of neat. I do kind of like it, so, uh, maybe we'll slowly start kind of changing everything out to that. Um, yeah, Crying Obsidian, that's, uh, that's pretty neat, neat stuff. I like it. Um, I do know a block came down here. There we go. Um, alright, so, let's, uh, let's go down. I, I think I got a little bit more in here from my uh, my other trading session with them. Um, let's see, it should be another. Yeah, I got I got, I got one. Uh, so I guess not as much as I thought. Um, but uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. That's what that's what I'm gonna start start getting. Uh, we have actually quite a bit of spectrals. So um, anyway, let's say I got that from trading, that from trading, that from trading, that from trading, that from trading. That could go in here. Uh, let's throw that in here. Actually, that's gonna go. Oh no, no. that go there. Some nether quartz, and then I want some mob drops, and that'll go there. And then let me do this. Uh, also, I don't remember how much I need. I should look back in my uh, my previous video and see how many uh, ender eyes we need. Um, so yeah, maybe I'll do that too. Uh, anyway, I think. Uh, until Hot and Spicy gets on, um, unless it's here pretty soon, this Looting 3 sword is, like, the best sword I have. Um, ideally, we want sharpness. So, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go get some, uh, go get some levels. Uh, let me put this block up. Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go get some levels so I can just burn a bunch of levels at the, uh, uh, trying to get a good sword, basically. Um, you know, we want sharpness 5, unbreaking, looting, fire aspect. Um, I like fire aspect on my stuff, uh, mainly just for killing animals, like, you know, those cows down there, 
you know, we could knock out a bunch of those if uh, if we really wanted to. With fire aspect and looting, oh man, we'd have so much food. Uh, so yeah, that's that's gonna be that's gonna be a big thing. Um, but that's that's ideal. Uh, obviously, we want mending on it also. Um, so yeah. So anyway, that's what we're gonna aim for. Uh, mob farm is actually coming in pretty good. Um, all right. So anyway, with that said, uh, let's uh, cut to the next clip. So the next clip. Um, is gonna be with hot and spicy in the call. Um, I uh, yeah, I don't want to do too much more without him here because uh, I do want him to uh, um, to basically kind of see the progress and all that stuff. Um, you know, we built that whole mob farm without him. Uh, we found the Nether or the end portal without him. Um, so yeah, we're gonna kind of rear back on what we're doing and uh, uh, maybe I'll just run around. You know, I'll get some levels. Hopefully, try to get that good sword and. Uh, We'll go from there. But uh, yeah, next clip, uh, Hot Spicy will be in the call with me, and uh, we'll be going from there. Alright everybody, welcome back. So it's been a few days. Um, what we did was we uh, AFK'd at the fish farm. I got uh, like 56 levels or something like that. Um, and I wanted a good sword, so what we did was we got this one. It took me a while to get the sharpness one, um, but we got sharpness four, which you know we'll eventually upgrade to five. Uh, knockback, which is just kind of part of it, sweeping edge and looting. Um, so both of those at three. Um, the only thing I want to do is I want to put this one on it because I want the fire aspect. Um, but for me to put that on, uh, it's like thirty levels. Um, so yeah, it's quite a bit. Uh, I'm not there yet, so we'll have to AFK again and eventually get that sword going. But uh, yeah, that's our best sword right there. Um, so I think with that uh, and the power five bow, we're going to be kind of ready for the end. Um, the main thing is going to be arrows. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to get some gold and we're going to do this. Um, so I know in the last clip I said the hot and spicy would be here, but uh, he's going to be on in a little bit. So I'm going to kind of make a gold farm so we can get gold to trade so we could get ender eyes um because ender eyes are the goal and then uh and then we'll do an end trip um but anyway so uh yeah let's uh let's work on getting some gold with the looting um i think it'll work pretty good so uh we'll go to the nether we'll make like a little mini gold farm and uh we'll go from there all right everybody so um a little progress update uh we made this little gold farm um, so I've been using it just a little bit just to see, uh, it's, it's doing okay. Um, it's just a, a two by three platform, so it's six total. Um, and they all go to these two, these two chests, uh, just hoppers. I use the last of our hoppers and our wood and everything. Um, but you can just sit down in here and just, you know, smack away basically. And, uh, they will eventually kind of be dropping in. Um, if I come up, so I have this ladder. Uh, uh, this is the this is the the design that I went with. Um, so uh, it's just basically like a bunch of cobble two up, and then over here I did that same cutout, and I put trapdoors so they think they could run and hit me right here when I'm standing here. Um, oh, anyway, cool traders. Uh, anyway, so then they run, they drop into here, and then it's just kind of a cycle back and forth. Um, I drop down here, I kill them, and then they drop their stuff, and back into chest. And then I just come back up, and uh, normally they stay aggressive for some time. If not, uh, I, have a, I have a bow that I shoot one of them with, and then they start running. Um, the only issue is they don't spawn great. This is about the flattest I can get right next to our nether fortress there. Um, so I'm thinking about... Uh, kind of extending out this platform a little bit further um, just to get some more spawns but uh, yeah anyway that's what it's looking like um, so the other issue is ghasts uh, ghasts tend to shoot me off here um, I was actually kind of AFK and watching a video to see if I can make it more efficient and I got shot off of here and into there uh, luckily there was only two zombie piglins um, but anyway that's that's the design right now so uh, I'm gonna kind of camp this a little bit get some get some gold stacked up and then uh, I'm gonna start doing some trading so um, anyway I will uh, 
see you when I get back with the progress update. Uh, I think Hot and Spicy will be on soon, so uh, when I come back, hopefully he's in the call. All right, so for my viewers, welcome back. Um, I'm in a call with Hot and Spicy. Uh, we did a bunch of trading. I was showing him in the end, uh, or in the nether, uh, the little trading system that we had going on with the uh, gold farm and all that. Um, so we got some more of this crying obsidian, and uh, I am one block short, so that sucks. Um, but the floor actually looks pretty good, so I'm, uh, I'm happy with that floor. Um, I did jack the, uh, the the floor idea from Vanessa, so <laughs> sorry, but it's all right. You weren't as smart as her because she made me put her floor in. <laughs> I know. I should have made you get... Dude, the crying obsidian's hard to get. It really is. Is it? Yeah. So. I know that for our next series, whatever it's going to be, um, I definitely want to do more builds. Like, this one, we kind of only, like, we each built our own houses and stuff like that, but it'd be cool if we could build, like... Like an like a giant room of uh, just for like the storage chest and like make sure like everything is like good to go. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> like an entire house for just the enchanting room, stuff like that. I think would be like pretty pretty cool. Um, and it's gonna extend our series too, you know. Yeah. What I want to do eventually is do like a village and but like a big village. Where yeah. is that Enderman? I need him. There he is. Yeah. I want to do the same thing. Like, I wanted to, like, I want us to do, like, one world, like, the same world, and work on it, like, almost every single day for, like, a year. And, like, just see how packed can we get this thing. Um, and just do, like, different builds and different, like, farms and stuff like that. Um, and I feel like that would be pretty fun. Um, just having something to always go back to in between, like, other projects, too. Yeah, like, I thought of doing that because of the, uh, like, if we did a village, um, you know, obviously bigger than, like, a regular village, but, like, each room or each building would be, like, its own thing. So we'd have, like, you know, a building dedicated to a, uh, a village trading hall, um, a building dedicated to, like, an iron farm, um, another one dedicated to, like, you know, a sugarcane farm, uh, oh. which, uh, you know, a sugarcane farm is something that I still want to do in here. Dude, I keep staring at this Enderman. He's not, like, coming to attack me. Now I can't find him. Um, <laughs> but anyway, uh, just stuff like that. And uh, I guess, like, give it a theme, too. Like, uh, I'm, yeah. uh, I'm, I'm always fond of, like, uh, you are putting down a lot of flowers. Um, I'm, I'm always have any fond love. of, like, medieval ones. Like, medieval builds and stuff. But Yeah. Um, you know. And maybe we eventually put, like, a whole... Uh, like castle walls around it and stuff yeah so yeah because that'd be a pretty cool time lapse and then maybe at that point we start streaming too and we'll just be like you know if you want to see us work on our wall just uh start streaming uh so i'm definitely down and uh if anyone is actually interested in uh us playing with like a texture pack too i mean i'm for sure down i'm sure that you and vanessa are all down oh yeah i would do texture win. To do a texture pack and maybe there's one that you know you guys would recommend that we should do then uh we could definitely try it out until we all get to like one that we're we're comfortable with um but yeah it definitely sounds exciting i'm, I'm excited for our next let's play i'm excited to finish this one when when we do finish it um so the, the, it has more to come definitely has more to come um and even though, like, like there are a lot of games getting ready to come out, games that I've never even played before and games that I, I literally love playing, um, just because we are going to be putting, like, multiple different types of games in our channel doesn't mean that we're going to neglect Minecraft either. Yeah, I know. Minecraft's always a game that we come back to. And that's, yeah. uh, that's something we've always said. We always come back to it. So um, I definitely want to do not just like open worlds like this, but you know we'll do like a like a sky block. We'll do uh, you know survival island stuff like that. Um, I think like for Vanessa, since she's new, survival island's probably gonna be the best like next step forward. I don't know. I was thinking the opposite. Oh, you Only could because just, just throw her in the sky block. Oh, survival. I, I was thinking you said the opposite, so that's my bad. No, I 100% oh, yeah. agree with you. I 100% agree with you. Skyblock, it, it takes a lot to be able to shift and, like, to know when to shift and to shift. Um, 
and uh, it's just it's a it's a headache um, to have to do it, and uh, and then you have to make sure that when you make like the cobblestone generator, make sure it's not going to be uh, um, like you're not gonna mess it up and make obsidian by accident, and the whole yeah. run is over. Um, and then we have to restart. Like and... Yeah, so stuff like that. Um, yeah, no, I'm 100% down. And, uh, yeah, I do agree. Yeah, so, all right, I do have one more thing to show you. Um, okay. And uh, this is going to be quite the trip. So uh, I haven't even actually showed this in my videos. Um, at least I don't, I don't believe I have. Um, so I found a skeleton spawner. Uh, so, oh, we got to go in the nether, by the way. So anyway, I found a skeleton spawner, and it's really close to the end portal. Um, so I ran around. The end portal's like really far from our house, and then I ran around in the end in that like fortress for hours because I couldn't find the uh, um, uh, the portal. Uh, but I eventually did. Um, so anyway, so I built this bridge, and this is a long bridge. Uh, these guys kind of spawn on it. Um, <laughs> oh man, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> so I didn't have you, you didn't get through. Mm -hmm. So right, the big it. ones can't actually fit in here. I don't think at least. That's good. But they can hit you through it. So um, anyway, so. Uh, this takes us all the way to the end, um, and I believe the end, we might have enough now, enough ender eyes. Uh, I need to see if we do. Um, if not, we could definitely finish getting the rest off camera. Yeah, we, and we might want to, because it's, it's quite a mission. Um, but the other thing is, uh, if we want to um, go to the end... Let's see. Yeah, I got six. So, uh, not enough. And obviously my viewers can tell that, and your viewers can tell that this is uh, my first time being here. I just yeah. got the achievement. <laughs> so, all right. So we need three more. So that's not, that's not terrible. Um, yeah. but anyway, if we follow this down, uh, my viewers have seen this, but your viewers haven't. Um, I basically, I needed resources to build that bridge. So I dug down and I was just kind of digging around and I found this cavern. So I was running around in here. I found some diamonds in here, um, just getting some resources. Uh, and uh, then we're going to go the other way too, by the way. Um, it connects again with like another little cave up you see here. see these berries up here? Yeah. So that's part of the, um, the caves and cliffs update. I wonder um, if you could eat them. So... Anyway, so uh, here's time. Oh, there's here's a slime. I know I hear yeah. it too. Um, anyway, but if we come this way, uh, we drop down in here. I found uh this right here. Uh, so what is skeleton. this? Wait, where are you? Where'd you go? I lost you. But I'm following this fish. Oh, 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 okay, I see. I think those are called an or it's called an axolotl. So there, it's deadly to uh. He dropped nothing. Yeah, it's a friendly thing. Oh. You so said anyway, deadly. Well, it's deadly to mobs. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. So anyway, so I found this. Um, so I uh, I dug it out. This is oh. basically what it needs to look like. Uh, so, and I think I just put a bunch of, like, Ooh. random crap in there. Diamond horse armor. Yeah. So, uh, anyway, so at some point we're going to want to build this out. Uh, but what I was getting at is we need arrows, uh, so because we're gonna need arrows to kill the end dragon. Um, yeah. So we might want to look into building this out. Um, yeah. But anyway, the main thing is we need to get Ender eyes. We need to finish the Ender portal, and then we need to go kill the end dragon. So. Uh, this yeah. Way. So. Anyway, for. Uh, for your episode, your episode just started, right? Uh, it's actually gonna be right around done. I'm gonna end it as soon as I find this slime. 
Okay, because that works perfect, because actually, mine's about done too. Okay, help me find the slime. Sounds like he's above, right? Oh yeah, he, we're for sure getting close. I found some gold, so I'm just gonna do grab all that because I need that too. Where the hell is he? Oh, he's back this way, it sounds like. We are close to each other, too. I'm just a little bit more below you. Oh, I found him! I'm coming. He's in the end. Or in the in the end, one of the end rooms. Oh, really? Yeah. Hey, I got new achievements for getting slime blocks. Or slime balls. Cool. Are we lost? Uh, yeah. Kind of. I have, I, I'm very bad at knowing where I'm at in this place, so. Because <laughs> I've gone through every single piece of it. So. Iron horse armor. You there? Uh, I'm back. Wait, where did you go? So I'm back in the cave. I can run back up to the portal. Okay. Let me see. I'm sure I can find my way out of here. So. Let's see. Alright, so I'm back at the portal. Um, Look, shelves. Yeah, we need more ender eyes. Alright, so I'm going to end it there for my video. Um, in the next one, we will finish up. Actually, off. we should probably just do it off camera. That way we could discuss. I see you jumping around in the background. <laughs> At least your name tag. I see you. I see your name tag. Um, anyway, so what we'll do in the next one is uh, we'll go to the end. Um, we should probably try to get Vanessa on for that too. But uh, off camera, we'll get the last three ender eyes. And then mm -hmm. uh, we'll go from there. So Yeah, sounds good to me. All right, anyway, so I guess for both of our videos, uh, thanks for watching, everybody. And uh, please like and subscribe. And uh, we'll see you in the next one.